There's only a very few um, science-related ROV systems in the world. Many are, are made for oil and gas exploration, but there's only a few out there that are made specifically for oceanographic research. Hercules and Argus were made um, as a pair. They're, it's called a two-body system, where both vehicles are in the water at the same time. Argus is much like the man, and Hercules is like the dog, with a dog on a leash. Hercules and Argus are rated to 4,000 meters and 6,000 meters respectively. Hercules can go to 4,000 meters, which is uh, over 12,000 feet deep. They were first built in 2002 and 2003 for archaeological excavation and ar archaeological research under undersea, and that's what made them truly unique. And since that time, they have done quite a bit of that kind of work. But they've also done the more traditional oceanographic research in the deep ocean. The bottom line for the missing bit of information that you don't see. You don't see on Nautilus Live. You don't see when you come and visit an operation like this. You don't see it when you look at pictures of the ROV and study the specifications. Um, the background story is that there's so many people behind the scenes that are working on the equipment. The, uh, the work ethic of this team, of the people involved, is, is just incredible. The dedication. It takes an immense amount of work keeping it going. If you have a probability that something will work of 99%, but you have a thousand pieces each with 99% reliability, take 0.99 multiplied by n power, that number approaches zero. And what that means is that when you get together all of these really complicated little pieces and you put them all together, the probability that something's going to break is pretty much unity. It's 100%. So we're always fiddling with this machine. We're always working on it. We're always making it so that it's ready for the next dive. Um, without that constant love and attention and hard work, this, this, we wouldn't be out there.